I'm here to introduce you to a place so far removed from society it's almost unrecognizable to the average American. We're in Dublin, a suburb of Columbus, Ohio. Life is a hardship and growing up is a battle. We sat down with three warriors in this fight to hear what they go through every single day. Sometimes I just want to cry. It's so much I hate this town. Oh, it's a bloodbath. I guess it's just hard when there's a lot of misconceptions about me, and I just don't like it. I just feel violated sometimes. Every day is a fight here. Every day is a fight. It's a struggle. I feel like I'm fighting a war every day I wake up. So I get, I get a lot of media attention because I play basketball, and I mean, how would you feel if you had someone take your picture and they just did whatever they wanted with it. I mean, I was on the cover of the Columbus Dispatch and they didn't even get a picture of my good side. So I look hideous in that and I don't get why they do that. I mean, I own like five pairs of Sperry's. I don't even like Sperry's. Okay, so everyone thinks I'm like this descendant from a large Persian family and I'm just a regular American girl and they need to get that into their brains. Everybody listens to all this alternative music, you know? And like, it's allowed and I don't understand it, but I have to listen to it. I just struggle with that every day I'm in my car and I'm like, why am I doing this? You know, why am I, why am I doing this? And it's just like one of the many things, I guess. We have a full garage and of course I'm the one who has to park my car outside on the street and I'm the one who has to wake up 20 minutes early every day to get the ice off the windshield and it's still dark outside and I'm just, why me? My mom gave me that. She put it on my car, she didn't ask. So I can't get it off. She's, she does the dumbest stuff, you know? She's so inconsiderate. So on the bright side, I asked the hottest guy at her school, star basketball player Nate Axelrod, to the school dance, and he did say yes. Wow, it's really exciting. Yeah, I'm really excited. Like, a lot of girls have already asked me, and I've said yes to two of them, so... It's, it's hard. I don't know what I'm going to do. I guess I'm just going to go with both of them, but that's going to be tough. Life here is harder than it looks. It's harder than it seems. And the only thing I can hope for is that it'll get better as time goes on. We talked to the principal of a local Dublin high school to get his perspective on what life is like for these kids. I mean, I can barely get up and come to work every day. The, the environment here is just, I mean, these kids go through so much just to even get here. Um, I'm happy when they show up. I mean, uh, you know, it's just a true accomplishment that what they go through in their daily lives, that they can actually even make it to school, let alone learn anything. I mean, we're just happy to have them, really. In the end, life's about the journey. And not all journeys are easy. But these kids, as you can see, continue to fight. They will not surrender. <laughs>